When I was a young man, I heard a story about a baby born during the worst storm in living memory. I was born at Dragonstone. Not that I can remember it. We fled before Robert's assassins could find us. She had no wealth, no lands, no army, only a name and a handful of supporters, most of whom probably thought they could use that name to benefit themselves. They kept her alive, moving her from place to place, often hours ahead of the men who'd been sent to kill her. It's done, Your Grace. The Targaryens are gone. Not all of them. I have been sold like a brood mare. I've been shamed and betrayed, raped and defiled. Do you know what kept me standing through all those years in exile? Faith. The Seven Kingdoms need someone stronger than Tommen, but gentler than Stannis. A monarch who can intimidate the High Lords and inspire the people. A ruler loved by millions with a powerful army and the right family name. Good luck finding him. Who said anything about him? In myself. In Daenerys Targaryen. You stand in the presence of Daenerys Stormborn, of House Targaryen. Rightful heir to the Iron Throne. Rightful queen of the Andals and the First Men. The lords of Westeros are sheep. Are you a sheep? No. You're a dragon. Be a dragon. I am Daenerys Stormborn. Of House Targaryen. Of the blood of old Valyria, I am the dragon's daughter. And I swear to you that those who would harm you will die screaming. Rightful oh, heir to the Iron Throne. Rightful queen of the Andals and the First I Men. Protector of the Seven Kingdoms. The mother of dragons. The Khaleesi of the Great Grass Sea. The Unburnt. The Breaker of Chains. The Cossacks. I was born to rule the Seven Kingdoms. And I will. Burn them all. Burn them all! I should know him to blame when the sky falls down upon me. Yes. Have you been down there? Have you seen? Burn them all. Children, little children, burn! It was necessary. You are my queen. No. Gregor Robotis! Grevy!